Hello guys! Good morning! Good morning! Good morning, mabuhay! Ang Pilipinas! <laughs> Today is our fifth day of quarantine. And are we looking pretty? <laughs> we got a new haircut and dye our hair yesterday. Oh, yeah. Frankie did all our hair. What about you, Daddy? What I, happened? I have plenty of hair now. You have plenty of hair yeah. now? How's your color doing? It's the same. It's the same? <laughs> I'm so happy that my hair is still long. I thought it's going to be so short. Makes me have a moon eye face. First of all, I want to shout out the Alfeche sisters in Panabo. Yay! We're coming! Um, to Boreen and JR in Davao City, thank you for taking care of mommy. And to all my nephews and nieces there waiting for us, we'll be there soon. You have some shout out? Shout out to Joe Ray for bringing us. Yeah, Joe mm. Ray for bringing us some fruits and soy milk and calamansi juice. Mm -hmm. And also the sister of Emmeline who actually brought us uh, Plang Danita yesterday and laundry the bar the laundry soap yeah makalaban ang migdaghan yeah. problema di may kalaban kay sige ulan sige jug ulan oh, din he so, grabe gyud bunok ang ulan so basa akong labhan dire wanna short <laughs> wanna say <siya> short <laughs> maoga <laughs> so what are we going to talk about today you know we're going to give you some tips every day we're here so for those who are planning to come at least you will come prepared you need, especially if you're traveling with kids, it's not easy. So we will give you some tips. Do you have any tips for them? Oh, uh, no. First, we have to talk about the uh, SIM card. SIM card, yeah, yeah very, very important. important. So you need to have a SIM card that works here. So we have, actually we have... That's a globe. Yeah, globe. Uh, prepaid SIM but I also nagpalit na ko sa eBay or Globe SIM prepaid because the, the the first thing they are going to ask you on those forms and questionnaires is what's your local number yeah that's yeah. what's your local number. number and we don't have any and all the all the information all the um, um, like they're gonna send you messages through your prepaid local number so if you don't have that um, it's hard to get any any information coming from them especially when it's time to get your swab test like for the schedule well so basically we only receive our communication through our email because we were not able to provide their our local number we don't have until like we came here the following day yeah just buy a sim before coming here I think two or three hours before you're able to buy a sim once you get once you landed in manila so it's better to have a sim and um a used old phone Phones. like open open, yeah, open open line line, open yeah, line, open line phones, phones so it work. can um it can work yeah. here to in the phone so you don't have to replace the sim on your your um the phone that you're, the using. Phone you're using the only problem is um like if you have if you bought another sim here replacing those sim is hard if you don't have that small needle so be prepared to get a Maybe a safety pin, I guess, put it in your um, in your bag. Your bag. Because we don't have that, it's just hard. We don't know how to put the sim. We That's... know how to put the sim, we just don't have the specific gadget yeah. to do it. But we actually just asked the the hotel crew to buy us a sim here because the one that you get you got for me is didn't really work. Yeah, I bought, uh, I bought actually uh, three prepaid SIM. Two work, two are working, the other one didn't work. Yeah, the other one didn't work. That one that was assigned to me did not work. So we have to ask number. them 
to buy as a sim and they're very actually very uh helpful uh touch down and you your phone will already get you messages that your phone is activated already so that's a good thing you can text your family thing is it's hard to com communicate to the hotel you don't have a local number with you because unless if you are gonna subscribe to your phone for internet international um like international plan plan that's also yeah. another option but it's gonna be expensive next is um sign up for gcash what's gcash, G-Cash? what is that only in the philippines gcash <laughs> <laughs> so it's, it's an app you just an, have to download yeah it. it's an app it's a mobile wallet. wallet just like we used in us we used um paypal no no we used um we used venmo a, venmo cash up uh there's a lot yeah, things like that. Yeah. So here in the Philippines, they use Gcash. Gcash everywhere. It's just like everybody has Gcash. Um, it's, I think it's easy. And the only thing we have problem with, with Gcash is um, when they verify the your information, it will, it goes through a lot of process. So it's, I think it's better to download the app and apply and register for their um their account sign up for the account while you are still in us or wherever you are it's easier because it's gonna ask for your yeah like if you're an international traveler it's gonna ask for your passport and things like that and you have to take a picture of the passport take, take a picture of yourself and if it don't matches it won't it will not work. Yeah, it won't work. Gcash is good <laughs> if it will work. And if it didn't, then it's no good. Mine it did not work at all. So I have to use Frankie's account in order for me to pay when I order something. So when you when you order online, because mostly here I also order online. They're open for online purchasing. So you can also use Gcash to pay for it. So it's interesting, like um, right now, you can actually order anything with Gcash, like buy any, just anything, online shopping. And Gcash, Gcash is prepaid card. It's not even a, um, it's not, yeah, it, it's not a credit card. It's a, it's like a prepaid. You have to, um, put money in put it, put money in it transfer so, from your bank account and put money in yeah it. so how we do it is we use our zoom account or paypal account and transfer it to gcash and it has an option to select what kind of mobile mobile wallet um, account so gcash is one and the good thing is there's no fee zero so um, you can transfer any. I think the limit is five hundred pesos, so that's about. That's the that's the minimum. Some, yeah. Oh, that's the minimum. That's the minimum. Yeah, the, the minimum. So that's like mm -hmm. um, twelve, fifteen dollars. Yeah. So. So you can't go beyond five hundred pesos. So we can actually. No, not beyond. Like less than five hundred pesos. Yeah. It has to be five hundred and up. So I did use it a couple of times while we we're here in quarantine uh, i was able to send some money to my friends or mm, have to buy something and they deliver it to our hotel <laughs> he bought the ukulele <laughs> <laughs> he bought the ukulele somewhere in kizan city and then yeah. they deliver it to us here in the hotel <laughs> yeah it's kind of uh sketchy but it works uh, I was so scared, but it, it well, works. we got we got the ukulele, mm. so I guess that's what we're they're using here. So that's Gcash. Mm -hmm. Anything else? All right. So third, um, we'll talk about electronics because um, if you're quarantined, I think you have to be prepared to get yourself entertained, especially if you have kids. So I my cell phones and ipads i've downloaded with games and 
and if you planning to bring your laptop with you you can download movies because I found out that the only um, streaming software streaming company that works here is Netflix so if you have Netflix it works here you, you can open Netflix it has a different as long as you have internet yeah as long as you have Wi-Fi uh, it has a different set of movies but it works um, Hulu didn't work um, HBO didn't work if you have um, Disney, Disney Nas, Plus didn't work uh, Prime now didn't work so I those are all the account that we have so I don't know uh, YouTube always works so yeah you, we always go to YouTube um, uh, Frankie she downloaded it to some sketchy website her favorite movies or <laughs> some cartoons so, yeah so <laughs> she she's prepared during the long flight be um be prepared to get some extra uh power banks um because sometimes like manila or the, the philippine airlines don't have really enough um places where you can charging charge charging. your your device charging and, place yeah and they don't have wi-fi it's just that's a 16 hour trip with no wi-fi that's right there's and no wi-fi available the movies are yeah, just old movies so it's um, and even in the airport the wi-fi was really bad yeah uh philippine oh no no this is it was naia naia yeah, yeah. the wi-fi is just i think you have to pay for it I don't think yeah. so. I, that's it's free, but it's probably because there's so many people using it. So it's like gabaktas, gabaktas yeah. ang Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi is not good. So, um, so the power banks. I actually bought three power banks. I was thinking I'm gonna run out. Uh, the little boy Zardo plays a lot, and the train uses a lot of power. And good thing that. Um, we, we are still able to plug in, but we use the power bank during that 16 hour trip. Uh, the only thing with power banks, um, air, airline uh, security, limit. they limit the power bank uh, capacity to 30,000 milliampers, something like that. So, but anyway, um, 30,000, that's already a lot. So, um, and it's heavy, so we actually, I actually got the, the 10 and there's another 20 milliamps, 20,000 to 10,000 milliamps. Cables. If you are um, planning to use your computer or your, your iPhone to connect to the screen, usually hotels, most hotels have TVs and the TVs have HDMI inputs. Please. Don't forget to bring those HD, HDMI cable. They're so useful. Useful. Here. I will use it <laughs> with um, the Just Dance, whatever um, movies we have in our computer, Netflix or just YouTube. Um, you can use it on the TV screen. So HDMI cable that works with your iPhone, iPad, or your computers laptop. or laptop whatever device you you're bringing so HDMI cable I guess that's all that's it for electronics yeah electronics just be prepared before you get crazy here you need to really have something to do because um, this quarantine is real it really make you crazy <laughs> if you have nothing to do and then if you can bring your family just bring it with you because they will help you to be to keep your mind stable and i guess that's it for today yeah until next time mga chulukoy <laughs> mga chulukoy <laughs> bye -bye. if you think this video is helpful to you please thumbs up thumbs up if you did not subscribe our channel pamilyang chulukoy Please subscribe our channel and we'll give you update every day in our quarantine. We have nothing to do here but do vlog in the morning. Okay, guys. Okay.
See you next time. Bye bye. Bye. Look at that. Day five. Food spa day. This quarantine is not bad at all. Because if it's not because of the quarantine, I won't be able to do this. Pumper myself. It's always busy. Watching the kids working. So this is like a blessing. It's a blessing to me. <laughs> Thank you, Daddy, for doing the food spa. That's my professional <laughs> pedicurist. <laughs> Anytime. Anytime. <laughs> what you doing now? Putting some food cream? Cream. After we did um, soak for 20, 30 minutes. My feet, oh boy. Callos everywhere. Look at that. That's crazy nails right there. Ew. That's nasty. <laughs> Sama na imong trabaho dad mo raw kag gapinta <laughs> nagpinta lang <laughs> Okay show mommy your painting Did you do that yourself? Yeah? Okay show it to mommy be Ready? Ready? And go Go Ta da Oh no <laughs> What happened to the dinosaur? <laughs> Baby, what happened to the dinosaur? <laughs> I could not find the dinosaur. It's wet, baby. <laughs> Don't touch it. <laughs> Please. Please don't do that to me. Okay, bye!